In this webinar on building a cryptocurrency market risk dashboard, we start by randomly allocating dollars into a list of arbitrarily chosen cryptocurrencies. The S&P 500 index is included to add a stock market perspective. The first step in the exercise is to calculate a market value. The percentage volatility and dollar volatility use a historical one-year range of daily prices. We use the logarithm of the simple return for assets whose price moves very quickly, as in the case of cryptocurrencies. The standard deviation of returns is the easiest way to measure volatility or risk at some confidence level such as 99%. The daily log of returns is a simple formula of daily price changes expressed in relative terms. Volatility uses Excel's standard deviation formula as a function of the daily price relatives. Volatility can also be expressed in dollar terms. Single position 99% value at risk adds a multiplier of volatility using Excel's norms and function. Portfolio volatility is a function of the covariance between cryptocurrency returns. Covariance may be expressed as a function of single cryptocurrency return volatilities and the correlation between them. Only one correlation number is needed when there are two assets in the portfolio. When there are three or more assets, a correlation matrix is needed. This matrix can be calculated using a closed form solution. Portfolio volatility can then be calculated also in a closed form solution using risk measurement as a foundation for portfolio management. We calculate a sharp ratio as the ratio of the average of log returns to volatility. The sharp ratio is calculated also for the spread between cryptocurrencies and Bitcoin using log returns for each cryptocurrency's price differential or spread versus Bitcoin's price. To prepare for the simulation, position weights in the portfolio and corresponding sharp ratios are isolated. The investment, its daily value at risk, and profit or loss results are included in the simulation. The embedded macro sorts results based on Sharpe ratio versus Bitcoin from highest ratio to lowest. Sorting by Sharpe ratio in descending order gives us indications on how to position the portfolio. We build optimal portfolios by investing in cryptocurrencies that have a high Sharpe ratio and divesting from ones that have a low Sharpe ratio. Future webinars will present upgrades to the base model. These upgrades include EWMA, or Exponentially Weighted Moving Average, to measure returns and volatility. Stress testing, when 99% value at risk is not enough. Liquidity of cryptocurrencies and selection criteria. Sharp ratio thresholds for rebalancing the portfolio and benchmarking performance. The full webinar recording with downloadable spreadsheet is now available. Visit the MMF eLearning catalog today to learn more.